What's up guys, Andrew here from Hot Wheels 682 back with another video and today it is the last day of 2022 and that means the last race of the year and yeah it's been a pretty interesting year to say the least for my YouTube channel, for myself, for everyone and yeah just it's been an epic year and yeah since it's the last race of the year and the last video of the year I just want to say thank you all so much for supporting me subscribing to me give me motivation and everything and I just appreciate you guys so much and I actually have a lot more content coming next year so uh yeah stay tuned after that Let's get on with the video. Now, in today's video, I am going to be doing Team Red versus Team... No, Team Red versus Team Blue. I got those mixed around. And whoever wins in this race is going to go on to phase those three. I don't know if you guys remember the previous three tournaments that we did, but this is going to be the last tournament of the year. So, yeah, let me introduce you to the cars. On... Team Blue, we have the Porsche 911 GT3 RS, the Subaru WRX STI, the GMC Cyclone, the Porsche 918 Spider, the Street Creeper, the Ford Transit Custom, the Ford GT40, and the Chevy Camaro Security Car. For Team Red, we have the Audi RS6, the Audi R8 Spider, the Track Manga, the Lamborghini Sesto Elemento, the Jaguar F Type Project 7, or was it Project 8? I can't remember. The, Port, uh, the Pagani Huayra Roadster, a Tractor, and my newest cars, I'm knocking everything, the Mercedes. SL, no, the Mercedes 300 SL with the camera will focus. But yeah, also we do have a bonus race right here. Fiat 500 versus Volvo 850 Estate. So for the last, well, the first race of the last tournament of the year, I've moved into my bedroom for a bit. But for the last tournament of the year, I've moved into this room as well. But anyways... Race one of the last tournament of the year, Porsche 911 GT3 RS for Team Blue versus the Audi RS6 Avant for Team Red. On your mark, set, set, go. Oh. So, as always, I review the footage and the Audi RS6 takes the first win. So that's one win. The, the, Audi, the Audi RS6 is the first car going on to the next race, or next round, excuse me, and it's also the first car to take a win for Team Red, let's see if Team Blue can bring it back or not. For the next race, we have the Audi R8 versus the Subaru WRX, and this one, this is raring to go to go for my cars. Hey, bubs! Anyways, let's see if we can go through one race like this one point to go for them. Anyways, on your marks, get set, go! Oh, and the Subaru won that. Okay, so that's one win to Team Red and one win to Team Blue. So, yeah, let's get on with the third race. For race number three, we have the GMC Cyclone representing for Team Blue going up against the... <laughs> excuse me, my cat is being chaos as always. But yeah, the GMC Cyclone for Team Blue versus the Track Manga for Team Red. On your marks, get set, go! Oh, that was the, <laughs> the, the um, GMC Cyclone. And this one is trying to attack it. For the next race, we have the Porsche 918 Spider going up against the Lamborghini Sesto Elemento. And so far, that's two to blue, one to red. Let's see if the Sesto can bring back any wins. On your marks, get set, go. And the short answer is yes. Yes, it can bring back a win for Team Red. Okay, so I have my little helper over there, but let's see. Street Creeper or Jaguar F-Type Project set, uh, Project 8. On your marks, get set, go. So the Jaguar was close, but not close enough. 
So that's three wins to Team Blue and two wins to Team Red. Let's see if the Pagani Huayra Roadster can bring it back up against the Ford Transit. But let's see if the Pagani can bring back some wins for Team Red. On your marks, get set. Go. Oh, and a little bit of a crash, so we're going to have to restart that. Right, so we've kept the Pagani in the same lane, but we swapped the Transit, even though the Ford had nothing to do with the Pagani's crash, but let's see if that makes a difference. On your marks, get set. Go. Oh no, still crashed. That's weird. So I'm going to give the whoops. I'm going to give the Pagani one more chance, and if it crashes out again, then the transit's gonna go through and the Pagani's gonna get a DNF. Let's see, on your marks, get set. Go. For the second to last race of round one, we have a <clears throat> quite an unusual matchup. A Ford GT40 going up against a tractor. Let's see who takes it on your marks, get set. Go. Oh, um, I also forgot to add that the Pagani won the race between the, well, the Pagani and the Ford, even though, of course, you guys saw that it won. But anyways, on to the last race of round one. And for the last race of round one, we have a very rare and expensive classic supercar versus a modern and very fast muscle car. The Mercedes 300 SL and the Chevy Camaro. <clears throat> now, if this wasn't Hot Wheels and it was the full size cars, I reckon the Chevy would beat the Mercedes hands down. But this is Hot Wheels. So let's see who wins Mercedes 300 SL or Chevy Camaro. On your mark, let's get set. Go. And for round two of the last tournament of the year, we have the Subi going up against the RS6. Let's see who takes it on your marks. Get set, go. So the Audi takes the first win for Team Red. Let's see if the Pagani and the Lambo can make it three wins to Team Red. For round, uh, for race two of round two, excuse me, I almost said for round two. No, for race two of round two, we have the GMC Cyclone going up against the Lamborghini Sesto Elemento. Let's see who takes it. On your marks, get set, go. And now for the second to last race of the round, well, for the second to last race of round two of the last tournament of the year, Street Creeper versus the Pagani Huayra Roadster. Let's see who takes it. On your marks, get set, go. Two cars representing for Team Blue. Only one can go through. The Chevy Camaro, or the Ford GT40. This is actually a Fast and Furious edition. But anyways, on your mark, it's going to Ooh, look at this. We are down to our last four competitors. Let me move this back. We're down to our last four competitors. Let's see who gets to go on to face the Lamborghini, the Escort, and the Mustang. So, for a second to last race of the semi-finals, or the second to last round, the GMC Cyclone or the Audi RS6. Let's see who takes it. On your marks, get set. Okay, so I'm going to have to redo that race because that was pretty close. I think it was neck and neck, but I don't know. Let's see who takes it. On your marks, get set. Go. So after reviewing the footage, that was the Audi RS6. But let's see who takes this one. The Chevy Camaro security car. Or the street creeper. On your marks, get set, go! So, looks like the street creeper is the outright winner of the last race of 2022. And it's going to be going up against the Ford Mustang Lamborghini Aventador SV, no, the Lamborghini Aventador J and the Ford Escort RS1600 in 2023. And yeah. I hope you guys have an amazing rest of the day and a happy new year for 2023 and don't forget to subscribe and like and I'll see you guys next year. Bye bye!